I know that Tom went through not a rigorous audition process, but there was a lot of considerations when it came to his character, lots, and they kept him waiting for a long, long time. Was it the same when you were auditioning for Desire? What was that auditioning process like? No. Um, <laughs> sorry, Tom, but you're not here anyway. So <laughs> I can, I, uh, I, uh, no, Tom went through the ringer, um, but I was, you know, I just, I guess, I, 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 I got it, yeah. I sent in one tape. Um, I was shooting a show called Cowboy Bebop for Netflix in New Zealand, okay. and um, they sent in, you know, like a, a scene from it, and they were like, just film this and send it in. So I sent in one tape, and I didn't hear back for a few weeks, and then the next call that I got was like, Neil Allen, they all want you to do it. And apparently, Neil wanted me to do it before I even auditioned, because after we exchanged, like, a message about it, um, he like he's stalked me on the internet and he was like oh okay all right and so he sent a message to alan and was like this is desire this is who i want and uh um, but they they said i still auditioned i don't know why <laughs> god's sake <laughs> do all that work i know but, but at you... least not as much as they made tom do oh Jesus. my goodness yeah tom went through the a real process i think it was months and months of waiting yeah for him yeah, yeah, yeah long time yeah i, I had a few weeks a few weeks. I, I sent it. I sent a, a tweet, and then a few weeks later, it was get up. your slippers on, yeah. get your feet up. I was just, like, all right, just wait for the cops. They scheduled um, my experience in a very strange way. I was in. I was here in London for like two and a half months. Um, most of it was waiting and COVID tests and an occasional fitting. And I thought that I was going to, like, go in once a week or whatever, you know, in the last month and, like, film a scene here, film a scene there. And eventually, like, after being here for at least a month, they were like, okay, we have your schedule. And they sent it to me, and they were putting everything on one day and then one, like, tag on the next day. So I had to shoot all four episodes in, like, maybe 14 hours of shooting total. And I was like... Okay, <laughs> uh, I guess we're gonna give it a go. And so I didn't have time to get in my head about anything. Like, I could, I had a mini, you know, like freak out at the the prospect of just doing it once and kind of like hoping it's good. Because you know, you in television, you don't really get a lot of rehearsal time. You don't get a lot of time to meet other cast members unless you're on the show for an extended period of time. But the way that this show worked, so many characters are only in an episode or two or, or you know, with me, like I'm only in uh, bits of four of them. And I interact with two other characters in the whole series. I interact with, you know, my, my siblings. So I didn't you know, meet anybody. <laughs> like, you just kind of show up and, and Tom was there and we're like, hello, hi. All right, let's pretend that we've known each other for a millennium. Um, and it was... and it, worked it was fantastic but i think the stress and the pressure of just being like okay remember your lines remember this choreography that we're making up right now and let's get through the day made everything else disappear i didn't have time to think about the character like or, or neil or any of the outside factors that probably would have given me a lot of anxiety so that was a blessing in disguise because i just showed up as an actor and kind of like threw something at a wall and hoped that it worked. And, I, and, and it seemed like it, it did, uh, which is nice.